Okay, I'm here right now. Look, hey, I got a little bit of my 100% uh, fruit juice blend mango apple, mango pulpy. So let me take a little bit of a little bit of this. Oh, this is uh, still water, but it's uh, natural spring water. Spring water is very important, you know. But you know, so let me just pour a little bit of spring water. Well, it's only a only a swallow left. Oh well. Just a swallow. And uh, uh, I guess I can, oh I have some more spring water there. Maybe I'll put more in the swallow in there. Put the open the spring water too. I just need a gulp for talking to you guys. Okay, look. <clears throat> I'm gonna make my morning uh, mouth mixture. You know where you put the, uh, you know, the coconut, coconut oil, right? This is about whatever. It is. I don't need, This doesn't even have to be uh, organic because I'm gonna be swishing around in my mouth and spitting it out, right? So I get a glass jar. I should have made something smaller. Oh, this is interesting. It just pops on and off. Okay. That's a good one. Okay. And I take the coconut oil. Uh, I don't want to shake it like that. I will. Pure coconut oil. See, we got the granules running around there right now. And I put a little, well, let me not do that first. I'm making this mouth mixture because I don't use the brushing the teeth like people usually do these days. And I got my turmeric. Yeah, this is the turmeric. Turmeric, which is, uh, in case you haven't noticed by now, the yellowing, not that much turmeric. I won't put that much turmeric in there. Now, what I really do need is my neem. And my neem is in uh, Dumbaza, so I can't have neem right now. I have turmeric. Uh, usually I put neem, and then because it's a mouth thing, I add, because usually what you're supposed to do is just the coconut, well, what they do is just coconut oil and swish that around for about five minutes or whatever it is, and that's enough. But I add the turmeric and the neem because what happens is if you swish around your mouth and it goes in sublingually under your tongue, that absorbs into your system, and, uh, yeah, this is clove. That absorbs into your system, and that's healthy for you. Uh, neem and, and, and turmeric in the morning is very good for you. You should have that. So that's the way I take it. Anyway, so now I'm going to take just a little bit. I have the turmeric. Well, now I got, and then I add cloves because that's a tooth thing, just in case you have any tooth pain or whatever have it. But I'm going to add a lot of clove with this. Not a lot. But clove with that. And my neem, I don't have, so I have to add that sometime later and so i'm going to make this mixture that i'm going to use every morning i have my little thing here remember see this thing gets it's got the fork and the, and the knife on there so when i'm traveling you know have a little sandwich in there like that whatever um then you add then i mix this up a little bit and there mix up the the uh clove and the turmeric. Not a lot of turmeric. It doesn't need a lot of turmeric. Turmeric is very powerful. I don't need to activate it. I could add a little pepper into it, but what for? I'm not going to activate it. Uh, the pepper activates the, the uh, turmeric a little better. Then I pour coconut oil in there like that. Not a lot because it's just a yeah, so I want to use that. And, uh, and I swish that around a lot. And that's my mixture that I use on my mouth. I, I swig, you know, it's like a, but when it, if it solidifies, you know, you take like a, well, half a tablespoon in your mouth. If it doesn't solidify, it's like this. It doesn't solidify, right, but when it does, when it's liquid, because it'll go from liquid to solidify. But as long as the coconut has got, has got a little neem on it already, then that's the, uh, not neem, um, turmeric on it and that's it but it's really the coconut oil that really does it i'm just mixing it around so that it sort of mixes up 
And then what you do is you take basically a round four and you swish around like that. And in doing that, that gives you the tooth thing. It refreshes your breath. It's good for your teeth. This thing is already not cooperating. Let me use my... Uh, get the powder all mixed up in there. But what it does, well, it does to me, it makes my... Because I don't... I guess I could take... I, I will start doing that. Uh, like the, the, the boric acid, you know. Yeah, but pork acid, you know, the uh, bicarbonate soda, whatever it is. I could take that with some um, with some coconut oil and uh, and brush my teeth with it, and that'll take the yellow away. But since I'm not trying to, how do you say, impress anybody, I'm not worried about it right now. I'll do that right before I have to do all this stuff in uh, uh, Narconda and uh, in Cape Town. Just like my, my my roughness here, I'm not going to impress nobody. Of course, my wife sort of is upset, but what can you do? But she, you know how wives are. They always want you to look good, you know, showing off their man and stuff like that, you know? And of course, same thing, the guy's got to show off his woman. But, you know, my wife is humble, so I don't have to worry about her wearing, like, mini skirts and attracting undue attention, you know? Even though, even though she attracts enough attention anyway, because she's, she's got this sensuality that just pours through and everybody wants to be wants her, you know. So but she has, you know, she, but she's she's gangster, so they can't bother her. You know, just, uh, so she says no gangster. Oh yeah, like me, sure. Anyway, so no we're in the village, nobody bothers us. Anybody Hi, can? that would be the wife. Uh, good. She, she and she avoids the camera, which is good what she just did. She tried to show herself but she didn't <laughs> but she didn't. Anyway, uh so anyway, so so the teeth is going to be this colorful because I every morning I I I well not I have the turmeric on my on my teeth. So people say, oh, but that's so unsightly, blah blah blah. Because everybody's pimping. I don't understand why everybody wants to look so good. Everybody wants to look so good for what? For who? Okay, for it. Okay. I understand, but it's, it's it's come to an extreme. I mean, you see these, especially women are all made up. I mean, it's like caked on. It's like who would want to be next to somebody like that? Say, like, if you if you're that obsessed with your with your um, looks, then uh, I don't know. You know, there's something there's something psychologically <laughs> wrong or psychologically happening with you. Okay, so that explains my my, my teeth the the way they are, and but they're healthy, and they actually with the with the swishing of the of the um, of the coconut, I think is really helping. And like I said, now I put a clove in there and the thing I have to add my name later, but right now I'll just go with clove and the um, and the and the I don't know what do you call it, the coconut oil to keep my teeth healthy. And the clove is like it's good for your teeth. Yeah, I mean I don't have any gum well, whatever problems. So that's it. I thought I'd let you know why because I you know that's what I do. That's me. Me, me being T from the Pattersons, taking the train to the bed, letting you know that I only suspect. Thank <laughs> you.